Hi all, this is Dr. Van Thiel and I wanted to take some time to answer some questions that I typically get from patients and I thought this might be a good way of doing it as opposed to uh, writing it out. Finally, uh, one comment that I get across all age groups, uh, especially in active patients, is should I stretch a pulled muscle? I think the first inclination when we have an injury to our muscles or to a lot of our joints in general is to say, I'm not going to do anything for this. I'm just going to let it recover. I'm going to let it heal. I'm going to see how things go with time. Actually, that may not be the best thing for that muscle. The way I like to describe it is that a muscle is like a rubber band pulled between two uh, ends. And when you have an injury, it creates a healing response within that muscle. As that muscle is healing, it actually heals up a little bit tighter than it was before. When you have a tight muscle, and if you've let it sit for a while and then you start using it again, you can actually create a re-injury pattern. The best way to address that is maybe a very short period of downtime and then some progressive strengthening of that muscle. It's going to take that injured component of that muscle and start to stretch it out so it get back, gets back to its normal length. This is gonna be the most comfortable way of returning to full activity and probably the safest too, so that you don't go through an injury re-injury pattern where you have an injury, it's causing healing and shortening of the muscle, you're not doing anything for it, and then you get back to full activity and you have another re-injury. The best way to avoid that is progressive stretching, progressive strengthening uh, in that injured muscle, and let really your body guide you. If it starts to bother you, you're probably doing too much. If that progressive stretching is feeling good, that's probably a really good thing for it. Regardless, if you have any questions, never hesitate to reach out. You can always get in contact with us on our website, uh, over email, or by calling to come in for a clinic visit. Hopefully this was helpful, and I hope everyone has a great day. Take care.